Obesity leads to diabetes because the body stops responding to insulin. Direct insulin injections can help, but researchers at the Salk Institute may have a better solution. We discovered a way that we can reactivate the, the process of, of insulin action and therefore uh, defeat the mechanisms that are associated with increased eating and obesity um, and hopefully develop a new treatment uh, for diabetes. When we eat, our bodies produce insulin to turn sugar into energy. Molecular biologist Ron Evans says scientists thought this worked like stepping on the gas pedal to drive a car. When you push down, that would be insulin. And when you take your foot off the accelerator, that is what most people thought stops the action of insulin. But when observing individual cells in the lab, he and his colleagues discovered a molecule that actually serves as a brake that turns insulin off. They wrote in the journal Nature that in obesity, this break works too well and can lead to diabetes. It's like trying to drive with the brake on, not a very efficient process. When Evans genetically lifted this break in diabetic mice, their insulin resistance was fixed. He says drugs for people could work the same way. We think this will be another way to give general body healthfulness that goes beyond just diabetes but will help many of the problems associated with overweight uh, and excess calories. He says it could even lead to a pill that replaces insulin injections for type 2 diabetics. I'm Brad Kloza.